how are you all i hope you all are fine and doing well my name is sayeda fatma rizvi and i am your favorite physicist and youtuber and i bring for you people the very interesting informative videos of physics ten ten and today we are going to study the sub topic of current electricity which is about the potential difference so every human everything possesses some sort of potential right potential mean the capacity of a person the capacity of anything to do something how much that person has the potential to go from one place to another place similar is the case that we studied the potential difference in case of electricity okay electricity means in case of electrical appliances right so today we are going to study another and other interesting topic of physics which is about potential difference so let's start what is potential difference potential difference is the difference in the amount of energy look not the point potential difference is the difference in the amount of energy that the charge carrier have between two points in the circuit so the, this is the difference in the amount of energy that the charge carrier as the charge carrier charge move from one point to another there is a shift of energy there will be the change in uh, the amount of energy and that that type of difference in the amount of energy as the charge carrier move from one point to another point or the charge carrier uh, have between two points in the circuit so that type of difference is known as the potential difference so let us consider an experiment let us consider the battery which has an electrolyte okay so a battery possesses an electrolyte okay an electrolyte contains equal number of positive and negative charges so the chemical reaction take place between them okay an electrolyte have two uh, there are two type of charges is exist in the world that is positive and negative charge so in this case the battery has an electrolyte and electrolyte contain equal number of positive and negative charges so as the electrolyte contain equal number of positive and negative charges so chemical reaction take place between them because they are aligned in the order the number of positive charges are aligned in the order the number of negative charges are aligned in the order so the chemical reaction take place between them so electrolyte works in that condition okay we connect the battery with the positive and negative terminal of the metal plate conductor the potential difference is uh, created between the two terminals of the conductor now we connect that battery with the positive and negative terminal of the metal plate conductor the potential difference is created between the two terminals of the conductor how let's see in the figure obviously the, uh, you can see that as the metal plate is connected with that of the battery there is a potential difference created between the two terminals of the battery okay uh the one is at the higher potential and the other is at the low potential obviously that the positive one is at the higher potential and the negative one is is at the lower potential so potential uh, difference between the two terminals of the battery um, is given by we uh, we name that positive terminal as uh, a and negative terminal as b so uh, potential difference is given by b minus a so you can see that uh, a bulb is connected with the circuit and battery we can call it as a cell so the battery is providing the uh, potential difference due to the potential difference the current is flowing in the circuit as a result the bulb glows the flow of current continue as long as there is a potential difference so obviously as i told you before that the the potential difference is uh, compulsory in the circuit for the flow of current as there is a larger potential difference the flow of current continue you, uh, you can see that the flow of current continue uh, the charges 
started to move because potential difference is such a type of difference in the energy okay as the potential difference is set up so the charges get some some sort of energy and they started to move okay uh, you can see in this case in this figure the negative uh, the electrons are moving the negative charges are moving which is known as electrons the electrons are moving from the higher potential to the lower potential okay the electron will move from the high potential to the lower potential so two type of current exists if the positive charge let us suppose if the there are some positive charges instead of the negative charge so that the convention that type of uh, current is known as the conventional current as the current um, positive charge will move from the positive to the, towards the negative terminal of the battery so as the positive charges move from the negative uh, from the positive towards the negative terminal of the battery that is from the high potential towards the lower potential then that type of current is known as the con conventional current okay So here we can see that the flow of current continue as long as there is a potential difference. Okay, the agency which provide for potential difference for the steady flow of current in the, is the copper wire of the battery. Okay, so the we notice two points that the flow of current continue as long as there is a potential difference. Second point is the agency which provide the potential difference for the steady flow of current is the copper wire of the battery. As the current flow from the higher to lower potential of the conductor, the current will always move from the higher to lower potential of the conductor uh, from the higher to lower potential of the battery through conductor. Okay, because this is the rule. As we pro provide the potential difference to the conductor, the flow of charges will continue and the uh, charges will move from the higher towards the lower potential through conductor. So the electrical energy is converted into other form of energy. In which form the electrical energy is converted? Heat and light. So heat and light is, are, are also the form of energy. So the electrical energy is converted into other form of energies. V uh, denote potential difference by V. Uh, so basically uh, um, potential difference is the amount of work done in bringing, uh, in, in bringing the charges from higher potential towards the lower potential of the battery. Which is and uh, uh, potential is give, difference is given by the formula V is equal to W divided by Q. A system international unit of potential difference is volt. Okay. So basically potential difference is also uh, known as voltage. We can also name as volt. Uh, in um, it's, it's unit voltage unit is volt is an uh, electrical field the potential difference between two points is said to be one volt so electrical field in an electrical field we define one volt as the uh, potential difference is said to be one volt if the amount of work done by one coulomb charge in moving from one point to another point is one joule so Potential difference will be 1 volt in such a case if the amount of work done by one coulomb charge in moving from one point to another point is 1 joule. So uh, we uh, give the units as 1 volt is equal to work done is equal to 1 joule divided by uh, charge is equal to 1 coulomb. Or we can say a potential difference of 1 volt across the bulb means that the that each coulomb of charge or one ampere of current that passes through a bulb consume 1 joule of energy. It means that the potential difference of 1 volt across the bulb means that one ampere of current 
that passes through a bulb consume one joule of energy this is very simple definition so this is all about the potential difference in which we have studied that what is potential difference how the potential difference exists and due to the potential difference the current flow from the higher to lower potential of the uh, battery uh, okay so uh, we have uh, discussed about the circuit we have uh, taken the example of the uh, metal uh, metal plate okay and then we have uh, studied that what is uh, the units of what are the unit of potential difference we have studied the formula of the potential difference and the necessary condition of the potential difference so stay tuned and like share and subscribe to my channel and spread my videos worldwide i bring for you people the very interesting informative videos of physics and i work hard on these videos so please spread my videos worldwide okay thank you so much stay tuned allah hafiz